Okay, so this is the picture I'm going to be using for line art. And you go up to the where the layers are and you make a new layer and you're going to name it white. And this is just because then you'll be able to see what the line art looks like without the pencil sketch behind it or whatever. Then you make another layer. I'm going quite slow. <laughs> And you make another layer and call it lines or <coughs> or something or, or line up. So then you go back to your white layer and make sure you can't see the background when you're doing this and just get a massive white paintbrush and paint the whole layer white. The reason why you don't show the background is so that you can see if you've got every bit of the page. So after you've done that you can hide your white layer and that will stay hidden the whole time now and bring back in your background layer. So first you go to, well it doesn't really matter, well you can go to pen, pe like pen, paintbrush <laughs> and make it black and I normally have it on three just in case I want to do a, a line that way. But this is the way I do my lines. Um, I start with the eyes or the the jawline normally. So what you have to do is you have to find your starting point of the line and then find the finishing point of the line. So I start at the top right and then I go all the way down to the bottom left and then I go to click on the pen tool and select add anchor point tool and then you can click anywhere in that line and move it to how you want so here I'm doing I've added three and so you can make a nice curve that way then carry on the way you're going on the same like you're carrying on the same line and then you join it up to where it started and, and then you just make it how you want to make it again So, after you've got the lines that you want, because you should be able to tell, <laughs> um, you go to Fill Path, right click and then Fill Path, and then make sure you have Color selected, and make sure that color is, I don't know, whatever you want to make it, but I'm going to use black, and then OK, and then your path will be filled. Now that was a, uh, quite a big area to fill the eyelashes and stuff so now next I'm going to do uh, the jawline a little bit but if you click white if you show the white layer right, right now so that's what it would look like so you don't have the background in it anymore so you can check your progress make sure you're always working on the, the right layer I do that sometimes. So here I'm doing the jawline and just do exactly the same as I just showed you for the eyes. And if you want to make parts of the line uh, thinner, like towards the chin, like I'm about to do, just make sure you leave the end bit. I don't know, you can kind of tell what I'm doing, but <laughs> you get a nice line that way. And then you can just check your progress again. <coughs> So this is how I do all my lines on all my pictures and that's why it takes so long so <laughs> I hope this helps and thanks for watching.